I'm Chelsea Tilly. I'm PA Project of Support to Head of Civil Construction. My name is Tim Newton. I'm the Deputy Physical Security Lead. My name is Amy Prohl and I'm an Internal Communications Consultant here at Hinkley Point C. I'm Denise Bingham and I work in CCAF at Hinkley Point. My name's Craig, one of the drivers on the HPC project. My name's Louise Brown, um, I'm the brokerage lead working in the employment brokerage for the HPC project. My name's Luke Lawrence, um, I'm a commercial assistant. My name's Amy, I'm training to drive one of the 100 tonne dump trucks. My name's Tom Thayer, I'm the secondary education manager for EDF Energy. dad moved down from the Midlands in the 70s so I've been wandering these fields since I was a kid. I'm a local lad so I grew up in Wellington um, and then moved to Bridgewater, I went to Bridgewater College. I live in a little village just outside of Bridgewater. An uh, opportunity arose where I could become a PA project support which would help me develop my skills. I left the, the army in, in 2012 having done 24 years in the military and EDF really provide a support network to transition into a civilian career. For HPC they're putting me through a degree and a 10 year experience. I've just got engaged so it's perfect for me really. My dad works at Hinkley Point B, my uncle worked at Hinkley Point A and my great uncle worked at Hinkley Point A as well so the baton has been passed down to me. Mom, Dad and my brother, we've all worked on base stations. So we used to work within the nuclear industry. My partner runs his own business, so I was pretty tied to the area, so I was really concerned that perhaps I wouldn't be able to find a role in my chosen field. So it's worked out really well. There's so many people here all doing different things. There's a lot of opportunity. I've always lived around the Bridgewater area, so for me it's really important to help as many local people as possible. It's very, very important to the project and key to its success. Somerset just feels like home. We really like the southwest. There's, there's so much to do. It's beautiful countryside, and it's a nice environment to bring your children up. Down. Got a granddaughter now, so <laughs> yeah, need to be around for her. Been here about two years as a minibus driver and helping out in the stores. So now we're moving on to bigger things. <laughs> The managers that I've had whilst being on the project are fantastic. They're very much for progression. They will talk you on training courses that they feel will help develop your skills. A lot of the people that will be working on the power station are still in schools now, so it's really, really important and key for us to reach out to them. If I had known about some of the opportunities now available on the project when I was 15, I would have seriously considered doing something different. It's key that we can get the message out there to families and children um, of the opportunity that's right on their doorstep. I guess because we work in the canteen, you, you see a lot of faces, so they're also friendly when you see them it's quite nice. Once a month we try and get together outside of work, do bowling, rounders down on the beach, going to the cinema, going out cycling together. There's a rugby match coming up in November. I'm hoping I'll just be placed out on the wing out of the way, but apparently a lot of other people are hoping that as well. I didn't know anyone before, so they were all new people and made some nice friends. A few nice nights out as well. <laughs> the opportunity in Bridgewater because of this project, it's massive. It gives so many people an opportunity because the skill set is so wide. There really is a, a job for everybody on the project, whether you are within the construction industry, security, catering, facilities management. The build is 10 years. At the end, I'll have a degree and a 10-year experience on a huge project, which is fantastic. I think it will carry on giving me opportunities and it will open so many doors. I'm really proud to work at Hinkley Point C. It's somewhere I've always wanted to work. For me, I'm happy to be here. Very proud to work on such a strategic project such as Hinkley Point C. It's a legacy, isn't it? It's something special about the project I think that people want to be involved in.